Hi everyone, so right now we are going to make our way from Leon to the Pacific Ocean in the town of Las Peñitas. We are extremely excited as this will be my mum's first ever time swimming in an ocean with warm tropical waves, palm trees everywhere and relax 100%. Due to the fact that we got here quite early, we can't check in our room, so that's why we are going to go by the beach area and uh, and by the swimming pool area we're going to swim there before we can do it and uh, i'm going to say hi to my mom i haven't seen my mom for like i would say a whole week uh, it's been a long time i would like to hug her and uh, i'm going to see my sister too and uh, yeah i suppose that we are going to have a lovely time here by the pacific ocean as you can see, my mum didn't want to waste her time waiting for anyone. She just took her complimentary drink and got in the pool. Whereas Carla and Yancey were enjoying their drink by the beach, looking at the waves. It was really nice to see once again my sister and my mother. I just really wanted to give her a nice lovely hug. But the Pacific Ocean, we just really cannot believe that we're here. All of us being together by the sea was just absolute paradise and perfection. So right now we are about to have a nice brief dip in the Pacific Ocean. We're extremely excited, extremely happy. And this is going to be reached the second time here in Las Peñitas. And uh, yeah, we're just going to enjoy this lovely day. And the sand is nice and crisp, warm, and the ocean also looks inviting. Having said that, many of the locals saw this as a death trap as many Nicaraguans come to the sea during the Easter holidays and unfortunately drown. So this sea is only for the most experienced swimmers. After swimming in the sea, we decided to go for a nice cold drink. Richard got a beer and myself I got pina colada. Right now, we all decided to go to the swimming pool together and enjoy the lovely fresh water here. My sister probably thought that she was Marilyn Monroe in Acapulco on holidays. This may not be Acapulco, Mexico. It is Las Peñitas, Nicaragua. I'm very grateful to God that we all had the opportunity to coincide and to come together to Nicaragua to enjoy this amazing experience. At the end of the day, the most important is to be in family enjoying the same holiday. Shortly after the swimming pool, it was lunchtime. So since we were by the Pacific Ocean, we decided to have a fried local fish with tostones and salad. I believe it was the best ever choice for lunch. Do you want to show your room? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Can you open the window? Do you like it? Well, I love it very much. I feel so sun, sun washed already. Um, now we're going to have a siesta. We've had a lovely lunch and it looks wonderful. Thank you have a lovely yes. view. It's an amazing view. It is incredible. Look at those trees and the water. I can sit here for hours. It's amazing. Even though this hotel was at the top range of the hotels in the area, we were extremely satisfied with the services and the amenities. So right now I would like to show you our room here. 
Even though we're not on the second floor, we still have an incredible view. We've got a nice view to the swimming pool and to the Pacific Ocean. So obviously we're extremely happy with what we were given. And uh, yeah, so I think that everyone is happy here. Mamá, ¿te gusta la habitación? Hombre, está bien. ¿Y te gusta la vista que tienes? Está bien. Hombre, tengo bueno. vista hacia los árboles y vista hacia el mar, porque no me gusta. Está espectacular. Ver, más, quieres, más no puedo pedir. Sí. Vale, que estoy muy contenta porque tengo una vista preciosa en la habitación que me ha tocado. He tenido suerte que tengo vista hacia los árboles, a las plantas, el patio. Y, aquí? y al, a la parte... ¿sí del océano. Decir? Tengo, sí, tengo la vista del mar y preciosa. Más no puedo pedir. Tengo una suerte. Que te cagas. Sí. Time to check up on my mom. Are you ready for the meteorological conditions? This was my first ever time with my mom swimming in the Pacific Ocean. Even though the waves were kind of choppy, this didn't discourage us from going in and having a dip. I have to highlight the fact that the water was idyllically warm and a lot less cool than every other ocean I've been in. And there wasn't any other way of finishing our first day here in Aspinitas rather than being staring at the lovely sunset and the waves of the sea. It was literally beautiful and magical. Right now we are all walking together to El Malecón of uh, Las Peñitas, which is basically the center of the town. And uh, there are a few bars and restaurants around. So my mom, my sister, Richly, Richard's mom and myself, we are all walking down there. Later that night, we were so lucky to have a spectacular lightning show over the sky and the roaring waves. Today we decided to wake up extremely early to appreciate the sunrise here. But we were not the only ones, there were people actually already swimming in the sea and I saw a few people also running along the beach. That was really interesting. Good morning everyone, so today is our first morning here in Las Peñitas and we're extremely excited because uh, we just want to make the most of the day. Uh, it is 5.50 right now in the morning. And uh, we decided to come here, you know, for a nice swim, for a nice morning swim before the sun gets strong. Because actually the UV light uh, can get as high as um, 9% and that is extremely high. So we wanted to avoid that by just coming quite early and here we are. So Richley is waiting for his mom and I'm waiting for my mom. Good morning everyone. So right now we are in the little cafe in our hotel. We've ordered five cups of boiling hot water because we like to have a nice cup of tea before we start the day. In my case I have Darjeeling and Victor's having some jasmine tea. Right now we are about to have something very typical from Nicaragua which is called Nacatamal. It is a mix of corn and pork it is really nice and uh, we also are going to accompany this with um, some Nicaraguan uh, corn tortilla which is really tasty and this is something that you should try when you come to this country <laughs>
Before going for a swim, a young child came to sell some coconuts. We all had a lovely drink and they were absolutely scrumptious. My dear mother didn't just drink the water, but she ate the entire coconut. Right now, we are going to the table to have a lovely lunch. To be honest with you, this is really strange because Rachel and I, we normally do so many things, but this time we're just literally doing nothing. We are just enjoying ourselves. We're going to have a rajita, which is a nice fizzy drink from Nicaragua. And by the way, I believe that this is the only place in Central America where you can find it. On this occasion, we decided to opt for the shrimp curry with tostones, rice and salad. It was absolutely amazing, as you can imagine, as it's Nicaraguan food and all food from Nicaragua is just heavenly and bliss. Frankly, sunsets in Nicaragua are really special and they are quite different to the ones we have back in Europe. Due to the fact that Nicaragua is situated in the tropics, the sunlight here seems a lot brighter and a lot stronger and therefore the effect on the sky seems to be a lot brighter and more vivid. And the colours reflected as well on the water of the beach is just something of another world. It seems like a living painting. This is most definitely something that we are going to remember forever. Hello everyone, so this is our second morning here and right now I am walking down the beach because I'm going to see the Pacific Ocean once again so imagine this is absolutely so amazing Do you realize that the name Las Benitas comes from the Spanish word the rocks and since there are so many rocks here this beach has been named after the Spanish word meaning rocks because it's very rocky and very rough You found a coconut? I don't think I can take this back with me as well. I did find a dead branch of coconut which is very attractive and I'm going to take that back. Now that we're back, it is time to enjoy the rest of our morning by having a lovely cup of coffee. You know where, by the sea. We are going to another restaurant which is outside of our hotel which is called uh, the bar of Doña Verda so basically they've got more Nicaraguan dishes which are typical of this country and we are really excited so they say that they've got like some sort of like seafood soup and we would like to try it right Richley we're really looking forward to this seafood soup apparently it's one of the recommendations of this place exactly so here we go
That day we decided to have a nice slap up lunch at Doña Berta's. Even though it was just next to our hotel, the scorching sun made it last like an eternity. People fantasize about coming to tropical climates, although in all honesty, unless you're in a swimming pool, then the humidity of 1000% makes it intolerable. Get ready to see Victor's mum with her five gallon bucket of soup. I was only joking, it wasn't five gallons, but this soup was to share between all of us. In our case, we decided to opt for the lobster, even though when the dish came to us, it seemed as though they were two baby lobsters, not as big as we thought. So this is our last afternoon here in Las Benitas, probably our last time in the Pacific Ocean for a long time, and we've come, all of us together, to have a nice dip in this ocean. Although we are coming to the end of this blog, we just want to say how grateful we are with Nicaragua as a country. Your welcome was absolutely divine. We will miss you with all our hearts and we really hope that you enjoyed watching this blog. Buenos dias everyone, this is our last morning here in Las Peñitas, today Richley, his mom and myself, we are going from this place to Managua where we're going to be spending one single day because uh, tomorrow Richley's mom is going back to England via Miami and uh, we are going to try to do one single thing which is to go by Lake uh, Managua which is the second largest lake in Nicaragua, its Native American name is Solotlam. In Nicaragua you've got two largest lakes and they are uh, Lake Cosivolca, which is known as Lake Nicaragua, and then you've got Lake Solotlan, which is known as Lake Manawa. So I suppose that this is our major plan for today, because obviously just commuting from this place to Manawa is going to take a long time. We have already packed our bags and we are about to get our taxis. My mom is going to go her way. Diane, Richley and myself, we are going to Managua, where we are going to be spending our last day in this country before she flies back to England. So everyone, unfortunately we have come to the end of our series of videos here in Nicaragua. Richard's mom has gone through security control. She's now flying to Miami because later she's flying to London, which is her final destination. We are extremely sad that she's going back home, but it's been wonderful. We really hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please, you know what you've got to do. Give us that little thumbs up like this and subscribe to the channel to see more adventures soon.